Now for a couple quick fall startups. Start off with the with my mom's car, the 2001 Mazda Tribute ES V6. Doesn't look too bad. We just recently put a uh, new ignition coil in this thing. I believe it was for cylinder number four. Because uh, it was running real rich or really weird. So, yep. But I think maybe this will help. Got this in the mail yesterday. Something from Pet Boys since we're rewards customers. $10 off any service, or merchandise purchase of $75 or more, 10% off of any service. Cool. I think that's going to need it more. Um, let's see. 85,048 miles. Still sounds perfect. Runs like a charm. Not a problem here. Purrs like a kitten. Okay. Yeah, now for my truck. Like I showed you in the last video, this thing's covered in leaves. It's been sitting now for about four or five, I think almost six weeks. Well, this is it, I hope. <laughs> God, I really need to get a new car. Even that doesn't work. Rear air, nothing works. Nothing on that works at all. That does, but it lost that setting. So I got a whole lot of other stuff. Crap. Fuel pump works. Ooh. Voltage is kind of low. Gas is kind of low too, so we'll see how she does. Um, 215,163 miles. Well, amazing. It's a Chevy, what do you expect? Ooh, real rich though, running real rich. Windshield wipers work? Well, that was a nice move. <laughs> yeah, real nice. Oh well, she works for now. Yeah. Even this thing's still nasty. Let's look under the hood real quick. Whew! Dad, gum. Smells like it's running on stale gas, but yet I just put a little bit in there. Odd. Oh, come on, you stupid. Just pull the hood latch. Hold on. Maybe if it's that slam the door, you get more technique. There we go. Let's hope nothing's living in here. I've had that incident before. Nope. Just dirty. 5.7 liter Vortec V8. The K&N air filter uh, conversion. Battery's still eh, reasonably good. 4 of 08. So... Yeah, anything in here, jumper cables, not too bad. Some remnants of the rodents that were living in here. Those headers look like they might need some uh, new attention. They're a little rusted out, but up top, mm, looks greasy, but doesn't look too bad. That's all rusted out. It's 
cracked and split. Look at the amount of dirt that's collected under here. This is nasty. Gross. Let's hope nothing catches fire under there. Yep, the dent's still there. It's starting to rust. Yep, two words, new car. That's what I need. Like I said in the last video, I'm gonna say it again. I've only got about $500 and nobody to co-sign. So if anybody's out there's got like a running, working vehicle and it looks in pretty good shape, and you'd be willing to let it go for about $500, um, I'd, uh, I'd be happy to hear from you. And that's only if you live in the Dallas-Fort Worth area. I'm not really willing to go w very, 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 very far for uh, just to get a car. So yeah, hopefully, uh, hopefully I'll find something. Sweet.